Hello students! Today's topic is about the process of determining the unit weight of coarse aggregate. The unit weight of the aggregate is defined as the weight of the given volume of graded aggregate, where the volume of graded aggregate includes both solid particles and voids in between. The unit weight of coarse aggregate is used in designing concrete mixtures. The voids in between aggregate particles that will be filled by the mortar can also be calculated. We can use the following method in determining the unit weight of aggregates depending on its maximum particle size. For this activity, we are going to use the jigging method for aggregates having the maximum size from 40 mm to 100 mm. We also use the following measure depending on the maximum size of aggregates. For this activity, we are going to use the 9 liter measure. The objective of this activity is to determine the unit weight of coarse aggregate. For this activity, these are the following required equipments. To calibrate the measure, first weigh the measure and record it as WM. Weigh the glass plate and measure it as WG. Fill the measure with water to brim, then cover it with glass plate in such a way as to eliminate bubbles and excess water. Weigh the measure with glass plate and water and record it as WMGW. Take the temperature of water and determine its density DW. Use interpolation if necessary. You can calculate the volume of the measure Vm by using this equation. To determine the unit weight of coarse aggregate, first fill the measure to one third of its capacity. Then raise the opposite side alternately about 50 mm and allow it to drop freely. Repeat the drop 50 times where there are 25 drops for each side. Fill the measure again two thirds full then jig it again with 25 drops for each side. Lastly, fill the measure to overflow then jig it again with 25 drops for each side. Try to get the aggregates falling out into the measure safely. Label the surface of the coarse aggregate by arranging aggregates at the top. It is okay to have a little bit of aggregates sticking out at the top. Weigh the measure with aggregates and record it as WMA. You can now calculate the unit weight of the coarse aggregate by using this equation.
that's it. Hope you like the video, subscribe, and see you guys next time. Bye!